With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Students, here is our question. In a new system of units, energy E, density D, and power P are taken as fundamental units. Then the dimensional formula of universal gravitational constant G will be okay. So here we have to find the dimensional formula for G in terms of E, D, and P. Okay. So let us take G is proportional to E to the power A, D to the power B, and P to the power C. Okay. Now when this proportionality sign is removed, here comes a dimensionless constant. Okay. So it is K. And here it will be e to the power a, d to the power b, and p to the power c. Okay. Now we will use dimensional analysis to find the values of a, b, and c. Okay. So first of all, let us find the dimensions of g, e, d, and p. Okay. So g is gravitational constant. Okay. It is given by force into r square divided by m1 into m2 okay we have find this from the gravitational force formula okay so the dimension of g will be that is force of the dimension m l t minus 2 r is the distance so its dimension will be l2 divided by m1 and m2 are masses therefore it will be m2 okay so g have the dimension of m minus 1 l3 t minus 2 okay this is the dimension for gravitational constant energy has the dimension of m l 2 t minus 2 okay d is the density density has the dimension of m l minus 3 okay and p is the power power is given by energy per unit time okay so it has the dimension of m l 2 t minus 3 okay and k is a dimensionless constant now we will compare left hand side and right hand side dimensionally okay so on left hand side the dimension of g is m minus 1 l3 t minus 2 is equals to k have the dimension of 1 because it is a dimensionless energy here m l 2 t minus 2 to the power a d has the dimension m l minus 3 to the power b and power have the dimension m l 2 t minus 3 to the power c okay now let us simplify it so here it is m minus 1 l3 t minus 2 and on right hand side it will be m to the power a plus b plus c okay so it will be m to the power a plus b plus c l to the power 2a minus 3b plus 2c and t to the power minus 2a minus 3c okay now Compare the powers of M, L, and T on both sides and find the values of A, B, C. Okay. So now on comparison, we have A plus B plus C equals to minus 1, 2A minus 3B plus 2C is equals to 3, and minus 2A minus 3C is equals to minus 2. Now on solving these three equations, we get A equals to minus 2 b is equals to minus 1 and c is equals to 2. Therefore, the formula for g can be given by k into e to the power a that is minus 2, d to the power b that is minus 1, p to the power c that is 2. Okay. Uh, we can take this k as 1. So, finally, g will be equals to e to the power minus 2, d to the power minus 1 and p to the power 2. So, this is our answer. We have Option B, e to the power minus 2, d to the power minus 1, and p to the power 2. So it will be our correct answer for this question. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.